Hey yo dudes, what the heck's going on? I'm um, Stoney here today showing you guys how to spawn in the new um, boar, pig, warthog type looking thing called a deodon. I almost forgot for a second. So it's called a deodon and what its thing is, is it heals. It heals. It eats food really fast when it's healing, but it freaking heals. It's a healer. You now have healers in ARK healers people this changes the game in so many ways so um, I'm gonna show you guys how to spawn in something just like my little buddy Pumbaa here um, but firstly I want to show you guys how it works so it sprints kind of quickly you know it's got a nice little movement speed for being so like short and fat um, but so it attacks I imagine because of its teeth and because of the fact that this thing is so stout that its attacks have to be fairly decent um, but it's thing, like I said, is it heals. Left trigger, I'm on Xbox One here. So um, left trigger, all you gotta do is click it once and it enables the healing process manually. Constantly healing. You're a healer, people. Bring tons of food. Food is the way of the heals. So um, carry this thing into battle, just maybe two or three of them and you've got yourself a uh, freaking, oh man, a freaking brigade that is, <laughs> not to be trifled with. You can turn the heels off by clicking left trigger again. So it's pretty simple. Um, that is what this thing does. It's what it's good for and it's freaking awesome. Or you can also not only take this thing into battle but you can enable its passive healing which slowly takes food. I think it takes food as it heals but it doesn't heal passively unless um, dinosaurs in the area are uh, low on health so it's already healed all of these so it's not going to heal passively right now but it is still enabled so if their health were to go down it would heal it so you can station these guys um, around your base basically in your uh, dino pins or whatever bird cages put one of these guys in every little area that you have a lot of dinosaurs and make sure that they're stocked with food and they're going to basically make sure all of your dinosaurs stay alive so um, it's really neat. It, it really changes like a lot. It really needed this. Um, so it's, yeah, it's, it's definitely worth showing you guys how to spawn it. So firstly, if you guys are new to this, you're going to want to make sure you have cheat space players only. Activate that and it will freeze all dinosaurs. I'm not sure if it activated. Okay, there we go. And then, so once that's activated, make sure it's activated because if that's not activated and dinosaurs are not frozen, then whenever you spawn one in, it will kill you or run away. But this warthog looking thing will probably kill you. So enable that and then do cheat, space summon, space deo, don, um, underscore character underscore BP underscore C and you have yourself a little Pumba Pumba booty so while you look while you're looking at it do cheat space force tame and then it is yours you can now ride it but before you ride it before you do anything make sure you do cheat space players only once again to unfreeze the dinosaurs Okay, see, um, my, okay, it's automatically healing, what's going on? Uh, oh, okay, so I think this, yeah, passive healing is on here, so whenever I spawned him in, he automatically started healing him. Um, that's really cool, I like this one's colors, it's pretty cool. So, uh, anyway, now you guys know how to spawn in your very own Boomba to heal. Yes, heal, I cannot believe they added a freaking healing dinosaur you can basically just role play all the more like this puts not just role playing but like I imagine people being like priests and having these things like healing and stuff like yeah I would love to play with some people that are down to role play because that would just make my freaking day I love some role playing and uh, picking roles and characters and uh, having the dinosaurs like according to your role and stuff, that'd be really cool. 
but I mean, this thing's, these things are definitely going to help in raids or any attacks, any group hunts, alpha hunting. These things are pretty freaking sweet. So anyway, dudes, I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. Let me go into third person for my cool outro with my dudes, my little Pumbas. Look at them. They're so cool. All right. So anyway, dudes, I'll catch you on the flip flop.